What's good, your boy? What are we back in the thing? Alright, know what going on, man. Another day, another reaction. Dollar boys, I'm not fucking with what's going on right now. I'm gonna keep it a bean. I don't like how they just tried to press my boy J Main. That's your homie. For some information that this nigga ain't want to talk about it, they done asked this nigga three times. He said, yo, you know what? I'm not even going to spoil it. We going to watch it. All I'm going to say is Remo, your little regular ass, your little funny looking little square ass, bro, with that little funny looking mustache that you got, bro, you're going to get hurt. Somebody going to beat you up, bro. Chill, you not Adam, you not white, you don't got the white effect where niggas gonna look over you doing dumb shit, bro. I'm sorry, that's a sad fact. I'm sorry, I'm gonna keep it a bean. You gonna get beat up, bro. Smash that like button, hit that sub. Let's get it, man, let's go. Intro tough. You with Kyra? Cairo, um, I would love to get you and Cairo on a podcast together. On a podcast together, I think that'd be great. You're probably gonna steal that idea for yourself. I shouldn't have said it, but oh wait, wait, wait. go go back. So you be feeling some type of way about me doing whoops? And I don't no, like I don't how they said they right. trying to say J Main. I and see Mark. you. You're smart. You're like doing the exact type of content that people are paying you for, but you're just doing it on your own platform. But I'm supposed to be whooping like that, right? I've always seen people leaving comments about that, like that, about you know different people that we do interviews over and over. But you're one of the few people who's actually done it, and it seems like it does pretty well on YouTube. Yeah, yeah it was, it's like I'm um, I'm f with this wave right now. I feel like um, I'm giving the people a, a little different. Like, yeah, it's one thing to go on no jump, it's one thing to go and say cheese, but sitting down on whoops with FYBJ Main is gonna hit different because mm. this this a funny motherfucker anyway. So we watching we watching it for him. And we watching it for who the f he can talk to. I'm happy he checked Adam on this. He like, nigga, is there a problem with me doing my own thing? Because you know that you had a problem with AD and them doing their own thing. I'm happy this nigga put this shit on Front Street. And Adam really didn't answer the question. He really didn't. Do you have a problem or not? He probably do low-key feel some type of way. But nigga, you got to get the fuck on, nigga. You got some strange-ass narcissistic uh, shit going on. And you think everybody just thinking about you all the time. Nigga, fuck you. Fuck is you talking about, nigga? Niggas trying to make their life, bro. They trying to make a living. Why the fuck I'm going to think about your weird ass all the time for before I make a move? Fuck. Too. So we, if you got an interesting story, it's going to over pop. It's going to overblow anyway on phone now. Right. And then you want them, when them names collab. It's gonna what about that. Cairo, though? Like, have you ever talked to him? Um, I ain't chopped it up with the gentleman yet on phone now. I be seeing him um, over whooping on my name on these yeah, platforms. Yeah, Cairo. Wait, what do you say about you? On phone them. Cairo, J Main ain't. What do you say? J Main ain't like this. Or I ain't like. Hey, man, I ain't like nothing, man. You hit me? It hit different. You over whooping mm -hmm. on my name is disrespectful when you don't know me. That's who's, who's got more Wooski vibes? Who got Wooski vibes? You or Cairo? Mm. What does Wooski vibes mean? Break that shit down. <laughs> I think Sean Kill Cotton people. Meant, like, murderer vibes. Mm. Okay. Um. Pretty sure. Me, do me a Cairo guy more Wooski vibes? Honestly, Ooh. Cairo has more Wooski vibes than you. Yeah, right, I mean, and so I don't think the, Cairo has an abundance of what the f that pole yeah. to me. I, I feel what like the f that man, I'm some type of soft ass nigga. Or something. I, I would assume that Cairo has, that has hurt more people out in the field. You did you. your homework on belt to ass. I, I know. I'm just like, I'm just basing my that on like how, how I hear people talk about people. I be seeing this comedian shit on bro. Stop playing with me on bro. Yeah, I mean, maybe I'm. Shut up, J man. You the softest nigga in Chicago, nigga. Yeah, nigga. You had the little cool little. I shot taste savage in the nose. But nigga, man, listen, man, all your stories came from getting beat up or like you about to get ran down on. They said you was getting beat up in the in the in the apartments. You see what I'm saying? Don't get mad at us, J Man. It's not our fault. You see what I'm saying? Cairo got smacked up in, in, in McDonald's that one time. But you know what happened in that same instance? We heard gunshots in the back, nigga. We heard gunshots in the back after that nigga got smacked, nigga. Fuck you talking about, J Man? You just got your you just got your car broken into. You just got your car broken into. I'm just saying, bro. So you looking a little, and then like you doing all this comedian shit. Yes, I love the comedian shit, but do that bring your gangster shit down? Maybe a little bit. I don't give a fuck. I don't think y'all niggas need to see me 
in a gangster light at all. I'm going to be funny all day. And nigga, if you test me, I'm going to hit you with that motherfucking shit. Y'all niggas know I got, uh, uh, I almost said short people's disease. My bad. I'm wilding. Um, uh, what is that shit when little people don't like, uh, tall motherfuckers? Uh, short people syndrome? Whatever the fuck it is, nigga. I don't like when a nigga, I, I feel like somebody always trying to do something to me. I feel like always, I, I, I don't even like tall people. I don't got that many tall friends. I be trying to fight them niggas. Like, nigga, what the fuck you on, nigga? You see what I'm saying? Come on, man. j man, you can't get mad at us, bro. Come on, let's keep it back. Wrong, yeah, yeah, I be over whooping. Nah, let me let me stop. I ain't so like that. So you think you put in more work than Cairo? I, I ain't like that. I'm trying to tell you that man is a gangster. He's a real criminal. It, hit it seems like yeah. That so nigga, and that Cairo like got Jason, that weird Jason voice. In Chicago. Like the one that that's like Freddie. They talk about the McDonald's shit, and he's just like a little too calm talking yeah. about it. And you're just yeah, like, exactly. yeah. I feel like there's something you're not telling man, me. Is here. Yeah. <laughs> man is yeah. ass. Man is ass. KTS Vaughn ain't here, is he? Nah, let me stop, y'all. That nigga KTS Vaughn is gone. Shut up, I'm talking shit. I be pushing a piece. <laughs> oh, now, um, people be trying to throw me out from that. Nah, shout out to Cairo. It hit different. Right. Do your homework. Well, maybe one day we'll get y'all. So, yeah, ho room. hopefully, though, um, I be seeing them doing decent numbers on phone Um, I've been trying to get a lot. You know what, Jay, man? I started thinking about it, man. Shut the fuck up, nigga. You better watch your fucking mouth. Everybody that was in that little McDonald's video that smacked that nigga, I don't know if y'all know about the Chirac shit. I'm going to give y'all a little background. They was on some bully shit. Them niggas came in and smacked the fucking shit out of Cairo. I think he punched him in his mouth, fucked him up. He was disoriented. Every, to the, right now, in 2024, every nigga in the opposing part of that video is dead. And he's dead. J Main, watch your fucking mouth. You might be next. A lot of the people in Chicago who got names to uh, put that shit together, but a lot of these people don't about? see the bigger picture. Hey, Kyra, you do a pop with Kyra, you, you better never watch get your mouth. Feature. I don't know if that was already out the window. Hold on, Herb. Um, Herb don't be whooping with Cairo. I mean, he did a whole interview exposing them, and then they haven't spoken since. So I would assume. Oh, they still ain't talking. No, Damn. I said Herb don't. ain't over that shit by now. Damn, you about to put yeah, some Herb, you butter on this thing or what? Put some FBG butter on this thing. Do your homework on the butter that I'm putting on. All right, so I recently uh I watched like an old <laughs> he's gonna get video. over high, bro. Look yeah, at this. He's doing the wax in there, right? Damn. Oh uh, yeah. This I'm is just... the end of this interview, by the way. <laughs> You're gonna get over high. <laughs> All right, what are you saying? He All right, so he I watched uh, he and his crazy. a trenches news and uh clip from like a while back. And you, who's who who's big deal to you? Who's big deal to me? Yeah, like who, okay, you know, here we deal? go. That ain't nobody to me. That's special Daddy. All right, so big deal. Supposedly, all right, so Trenches News said that Big Dill son killed his other son and Fat Shawty in the altercation and shit. You, I, I, did you see that clip? No, nah, I don't know nothing about that. One. Awkward silence. So, uh, but, it, all right, so Fat Shawty, he was hanging around uh, Cash a lot, right? I think I seen him in the truth teller. Is that, is that the same dude? Asking them stupid questions. Hey, I said I don't know nothing about that. Two. Nah, but it's fast shorty the same. Like, 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 come on, bro. This is supposed to be a homie. If you say, bro, I don't know nothing about that, that's very out of character for J Main. J Main just got very out of character. If you see that shit, let him rock. That's your homie. Adam, you real weird for, for not really like kind of interjecting already. I'm going to keep it a bean. You on some bullshit. We're going to let you keep going. I'm pissed right now. Why the fuck did you just do this to this nigga? And he'll... You, you see how he move right now? Nigga, that be hanging out oh. with Cash. Like, ain't y'all friends and shit? Ain't y'all friends? I said I don't know nothing about that. Well, we finally found a topic he doesn't want to whoop about. Yeah. Okay. We got to respect that. Can I just ask you about this? So, you know Andrew Callahan from uh, Channel 5? Andrew who? Callahan, the dude with the red hair who went to O Block and shit. You got a crazy ass popping YouTube channel. You probably seen him. Andrew Callahan. No, I ain't, he, I ain't familiar. He did an O Block vlog, whatever. He's a good guy. He's, he's got Let me see the whoop. Let me see the whoop because you over whooping. He's a good guy. You don't even fucking know him. <laughs> I do How, know him. I've been around him plenty of times. How many times? How many times, bro? Uh, I don't know, like three times or something. Maybe plenty. four plenty. times. Plenty. Uh, and, and it's something else that didn't rub that rubbed me the wrong way because Adam finally did deviate the conversation. It's crazy how 
bitch ass niggas and soft ass niggas and square ass niggas and niggas that wear their hat straight uh, with a funny looking mustache and a strange short beard like uh, Remo um, do, you are like strangely detached from this shit. Like, you could tell when a nigga never been through some bullshit and it really bothers him. Did you just ask this nigga more than one time about some shit that, your homie, let's not talk about that on camera, bitch. That nigga, you said he just killed his sons, bro. The fuck is you talking about? You the fuck is you talking about, my nigga? You lucky that nigga can't come over and smack the shit out you. You lucky you got one of the nicer niggas on this little Chicago shit. I'm going to keep it a bean because a lot of niggas would have smacked the taste out your mouth. Oh, bro. I'm going to keep it a bean with you, Remo. And they would have took advantage of the fact that you the softest nigga in the fucking room. And I'm saying, yeah, I know Adam's in the room. The nigga that get his bitch fucked by niggas. That don't stop me from saying what I'm saying, soft ass nigga. Remo. That's plenty. That's like a lot of times for me. No, but we've talked a yeah, lot. Yeah, you famous as hell. Yeah, we is talked a lot. Time for you. This is him. The white guy? Yeah. Oh, good guy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but he just hit me up, and he said... "Is a white guy in a picture of the crowd full of niggas. He, oh, he, good guy. <laughs> see, he texted me, and he said, Oh, sh**. What happened with big folks pop? That would be so good. And I don't know what this means, but he sent me a screenshot of big folks pop on Instagram and his story, and it says... Man, I apologize to my peoples, but I ain't get the podcast interview. They canceled last minute. I was literally less than an hour away. Shit phony. They gonna say FYBJ May missed his flight at no jumper. So did, did you bail on this guy and break his heart? He did. I'm confused as f Hold on. How they know I missed my flight? Go back. I mean, this is what it said. It's, it seems like he had a, an interview mm -hmm. booked with you. Man, I apologize to my peoples, but I ain't get the podcast interview. They canceled last minute. I was... This... This is the actions of a nigga that know exactly what the fuck he did. And he trying to act confused. He trying to save face. He funny as hell. Adam, you was a wrong nigga for putting this nigga on the spot like this. This nigga, J-May, know he banked that fucking, uh, that, that pocket, <laughs> that bread and shit. He put that shit in his pocket like, uh, nigga, fuck this nigga. He said... He trying to act like he don't see the words. Y'all know when y'all, uh, when a nigga say some, some stupid shit, you like, you... You go read that shit like that? He said, what? Nigga, you know you did that shit, man. Yo, you got your homework, bro? You start looking in your book bag. Nigga, you know that shit ain't in your book bag. Nigga, get your fuck, get your dumb ass home, bro. Literally less than an hour <laughs> away, shit. They gonna say J-Man missed his flight. Why you gotta re-read re the whole thing? Who did they book that with? I don't know. You! I'm thinking maybe That's I got the same scammed. thing that Almighty Suspect was talking about today on the news, and we was trying to figure out who books your shit. So they they wanted to do an interview with me on Whoops. It seems like he had it booked, and then who did they pay? That's what I want to know. Like, cause they ain't paid me, then they ain't paid my publicist. Yeah, nigga, they paid. And how you. did they know you was in Cali? Yep, he did it, nigga. I mean, he 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 apparently knows that you're in the jumper too because he tagged us. I mean, somebody here knows <laughs> something. Somebody saying something. Goddamn it, it's different. I just asked Andrew. I said, "Who did he pay?" J Man has no clue what you're talking about. So. Right, it hit different. Cause I mean, I, I doubt you'd be like scamming for fucking interviews. That would be Hell kinda... no, scamming them for an interview would be crazy. That's great. Yeah, and that's the same comedian dude, right? What's his name? Is it? Hey, I don't folks. even know who he is, but I seen a, a picture of him at the fucking store. And y'all keep bringing this up like it was a real situation, and we and y'all just not trying to tell me this when I came to no jumper. Like, yeah, um, somebody was trying to do an interview. It's crazy. Uh, we'll, we'll see what Andrew says. I guess. Okay. When you come on uh, No Jumper, uh, J-Man, you got to expect to get embarrassed, stupid. It's not content if you don't get embarrassed, dummy. There's going to be a few uh, pop quizzes on that motherfucker, nigga. You might not know the answers, nigga. <laughs> you don't know the answers to this, this shit, nigga. I, I could tell they just hit you with a lot of blindside shots just now because you ain't want to answer that motherfucking question. That's some bullshit. That's crazy. They just hit you with hella blindside shits because you ain't want to answer that question about that nigga. That's crazy. So they had to make content another way. They funny. They funny. Remo, you, I hope, I'm just going, I hope you don't get hurt doing this, man. You want to be an Adam Lapdog that can do all the questions and shit? 
Go do it, nigga. Let's see how long before this nigga is smacking it in his mouth. Fuck is you talking about? Smash that like button. I love the gang. I'm going to catch y'all on the next one. Smash that like. Sub, you know what time it is, man. Peace.